We're going to talk about range selection. We're doing the same test with a 16 square inch hole in the duct, roughly, and we're on the open range. Looking at the gauge over here, we don't have any CFM reading, and it says flow too low, meaning the flow pressure signal is too low. So let's go to extremes and change it to the lowest possible range and see what happens there. We've achieved our pressure just fine. We've got 25 pascals. But whenever you hear the fan running at a very, very low speed like that, in this case only about 15% of full speed, that's a good indication that the fan speed may be too low to get a good pressure signal or a good fan pressure signal. So we're going to now change that to the low range. Do you notice the fan starts speeding up? We can change the range configuration here, but what you will notice is that it won't actually achieve the desired test pressure. Test pressure is 2.9. Fan speed is 65%. It's quite clear that we're not going to achieve the pressure we desire. So we have to change back to the mid-range. which easily achieves the pressure that we require. Notice the fan speed coming down. We'll change this back to the range that we're on, which is the mid-range. We're back to approximately the same result that we had before, which was around 90 CFM at 25 pascals.